Peace friends, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to the vibes. So today I decided to switch it up a little bit, you know, smell the trees, smell the roses, be out in nature, you feel me? So I'm on a little day trip to my hometown in Maryland. I had an orthodontist appointment. So I thought, you know, why not stop, test out the new medium format camera that I got and, you know, see what we want. Um, so I have a Yashica C medium format, which is a TLR. Um, and all that really means for those who don't, you know, shoot film at all is that the top lens is a viewing lens and like, and the second lens is the lens that actually takes the photos. Um, and one cool thing, <laughs> it expands. It's a whole thing. Like it, it is a whole machine. So I'm excited to test this out. I got some Kodak very color off of ebay it is expired film because listen i am not about to be here trying to camera out on some expensive film no we're going to try it out with the cheap stuff which is usually the expired film um and this one actually expired in 1996. yeah we're gonna go ahead load this up enough yapping we're just gonna get right into it and have some fun <music> So now I'm at my favorite park, Allen Pond. Right now I'm just chilling for a little bit. Um, drinking beet juice, cause I'm on a juice fast. Shout out to Be Thyself for inspiring me to be on it. But I just wanted to, you know, drop in and say we at the second location, you know, we taking photos. But yeah, so we're gonna get back into this video. That pretty much concludes this video. Um, I had an awesome time photographing with the Yashica. I really love the square format. 
Um, though I shot an expired film and it was a Kodak very color, you could see that the expiration, it's about 24 years since it expired. You know, the warm tones that Kodak usually offers was now kind of like this blue-ish haze, if you will. Um, I didn't really do anything, like I didn't change the stops or anything, I kind of shot it as it was. And I liked that, I liked how the photos came out. My favorite has got to be the two ducks in the water. It's just something about like the blue of the water that makes it look so supernatural yet so serene at the same time. And it's like two birds. I call this one love birds. Shooting the Yashica is definitely a learning curve. I mean, it's a fully mechanical camera. So sometimes I would like forget to advance the film so it will cause a double exposure or I would advance the film and forget that I advanced the film so I had a few blank frames. It is a little different in terms of the viewfinder as well. Like it's a, it's an opposite, it kind of mirrors it. So if your lefts are your rights and your rights are your lefts. It's like the perfect way to describe it. But besides that, I really enjoyed it. Like for it to be my first medium format camera ever, um, it was a good time. Um, and I'm also still learning too, you know, with this YouTube thing and with videoing. So that was just an opportunity to like kind of practice different angles or, you know, different things. Cause as you can see in the first clip, it was super, super bright. Now I'm realizing, oh, I should have tried, you know, a different, you know, shutter speed ISO combo, you know, to achieve a better light setting. But again, this is all like, I'm literally learning on the spot. So that's why this journey is so exciting to me. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching and being a part of that. Let me know in the comments what was your favorite photo. Have you shot the Yashica or any type of Yashica at all, a TLR by any means? You know, leave something down and see you in the next video. Till next time, peace. <laughs>